I've come to the conclusion that the world of Tarkov is telling us something. It is time to head back to Shoreline. Check out those generators and possibly grab some loot. This episode, we focus on Shoreline and completing the tasks. The Ride to Riches series continues. Are you ready? What is up ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the next episode of the Rag to Riches series. This episode we are moving on to Shoreline to finally hopefully get the West Wing and the East Wing generators for Spa Tour Part 4. Hoping to get that thing done. It's, it's a nuisance and I want to get it done. But I need to buy a couple things. I need to buy the sword in so I have some Comtax on. That should be good. I'm also bringing in the MP153 again because we're going to try to get those shotgun kills. And uh, yeah, hopefully we'll be able to go in some of the rooms and get some nice, lovely loot. I have all the keys that we need, I believe. Yeah, we have all of our keys. This is all of our shoreline keys. Well, not all of them, most of them. So I'm very happy about that. We're mainly, mainly, mainly focused on the 226 here. And then there's one more on the West Wing, which I don't think I have the key yet just yet for that one. But either way, we're going to hopefully get some use out of them and also get some kills. So. Without further ado, let's head out to Shoreline and let's go get this spa tour part four completed. Okay, we are in and I think we're close to the resort. I believe so. Yeah, it's right there. Cool. We're on the, the side that I like to be on right now. Uh, let's see here. This is going to be the east side, right? Just double check something. I know I was going to push the spine a little bit. Yeah. So we'll be on the, we'll be on the east side. 220 is where we're heading to. While we're on the 200 floor, we might as well, like I said, try to hit up 226, see if the LEDX is there. If it is, well, that's just kind of a bonus. That is just somewhat of a bonus. Now, if we can get through all these, these spa tour parts, it's going to push us into even more of the peacekeeper tasks. So we've got, a, we actually have a lot of tasks we're still going to complete because once we get into, I think it's part seven we get past, it pushes us into like cargo part one, two, three, and so on and so forth. A lot of quests, pretty much. But we already know how the how the drill goes with this game. A lot of quests, gotta complete a lot of them, but we're gonna get there. So keep an eye on my left side, make sure I'm not getting pushed on. Not the best spot ever, but I gotta gotta watch my stamina. Oh, that was right on me. I think he's inside. Let's get a uh, SVDS. We're gonna go push the other side first. We'll go to room 220 and then we'll go back. Got yeah, through a lot of grenades in this. Holy crap. Crap, there's a person. Got a Mosin too.
Holy crap, holy man. Oh, the resort's so scary. <laughs> holy crap, dude. Oh, everyone's sitting there right now, man. This is like cray cray. Every time I'm about to go over there just to, just to get a couple quests done, man. Everyone just swarms. Ah, well. It is what it is, right? Woo! One, two, three, apparently. I didn't hit anybody with any shots. I thought the guy, the first guy we were firing firing at maybe would have maybe gotten a couple kills. Unfortunate. We got hit in the face. Actually, it wasn't even the face. It was the headshot. He hit us right in the helmet. Okay, well, then we got to come up with a different plan on this one now. Because we still got to get those quests done. Like, the spas, the spa tour part four has got to get done at some point. It's one of the more annoying ones, considering like it's in one of the more prime locations that you have to go to. So yeah, we're definitely gonna have to try to get that stuff. What do we have? Okay, keep saying that I have like loot when I don't. I guess we bring the SKS. Give it, give it a go on that way. Get the armor on. Do repair. Um, I'm not bringing this helmet because I got to use that helmet at some point. We're going to do some money runs too soon because we are getting very low and I don't really have stuff I want to sell. Okay, let's get a sword in. We're just going to kind of go on budget run because we don't have a lot. Let's get this guy here. I'll put him back on because I pulled it off to actually put it on the other weapon that we had. I thought I had a chest rig that was useful. Maybe I used them all. Probably did. Let's just get a bank robber then. Buy one of these. We're going to go pretty budget right now on all this stuff. I still got meds, which is good. We use the IFAC. Let's go get ourselves painkillers. Five on that. Where's the other magazine? There it is. Reload. This guy loaded up. I gotta get some more BP rounds. Taking 120. Actually, this would be more than enough. I don't need 120 now I think about it. Okay, that'll be good. Grab a couple grenades with us. Backpack. Er, I should bring one. Because if it's if it is like there there's gonna be those raids where it's like you have a ton of players or you have no players. You have a ton of players or you have no players. It's it's like it's, there's never any between. It's either there is a ton or there isn't a ton. So I should bring it back just to have it. That should be good. I'm happy with that. Um Yeah, let's make let's let's go. I'm gonna I'm gonna go with that. Let's try this again. Cross our fingers that so we're not gonna die. Let's go. And then Tarkov does this. Then we have to wait it out. <sighs> Finally, finally it let us in. I did have to do a quick restart the game, but we are behind everybody. This really, really sucks. I was hoping not to be behind everyone, but we'll we'll have to do what we can. My my idea now, since we're so far behind, well, for one, people are probably already getting inside of the uh, the resort, getting all the loot anyway. So we could just come in from behind them. And, uh, especially where we're going now. We're going to be coming in through the west side, so. Hitting up the west side one. Hi, buddy. That was uh, not nice of you to scare the heck out of me. Just take the whole thing. And, oh, I can't. Well, well, I can. I mean, obviously I can, but. Okay. The west side should already be hit. So we'll head over to 220 over there, unlock the door, get the first one. And we could probably go all the way out on the outside, and go throughout the outskirts. Go in from the other entrance. That may work. There may be another scab over here. No, oh, there actually isn't. That's weird. There's like almost always a scab by that truck. Unless that was the scab that we killed. Okay. Let's 
Just inside of the resort. <laughs> that was a player. I didn't even see him. Didn't even see him there. Oh, uh, is 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 the resort or the bane of our existence or something, or is it just is it just me? I f I feel like this map has just been pure garbage to us. Like I've had better luck on <laughs> I've had better luck on the uh, on, on woods than I had this map. I got shot by PS rounds, yeah. Huh. So loads us in late. Run to a player. I hear said player through bushes. Didn't see him, and then I got shot in the face. Rough days, man. Rough days. It's hard. It's hard to have have a uh, start like this on an episode, but it is what it is. I mean, you, you you can't do anything about it. You just have to pretty much just go look at it and go. You know what? Oh well. Oh well. Oh man. Okay, well, I got to think of an idea here. Let's see what we have available to us. Mechanic, do you have any weapons available for you? This isn't that bad of a weapon, and the trade's not horrible. Actually, how much is this just straight up? If someone actually sold it like that, which I don't think anyone would. It's about 47,000. How much is it if you were to buy like the attachments and stuff? I may be better off just buying it myself. Filter. Let's buy that. I'm just buying the attachments that come with it because I've used this before and it's actually a really decent weapon. Anything else I need to really worry about? I'm not going to use that one. I'll get the other one that I'd like to use. Okay, let's do a filter by item. Make sure this one's actually good to use. It is. Although, hold on, back it up. Let's go look at this again in detail. This is what I need. This is what I, I need to find that. No, not link it. <laughs> I need to, to filter it. Do a filter by. Oh, mechanic actually sells us. Okay. Then we're actually okay with this. Oh, maybe we do have to actually use that attachment. Now I think about it, because it's like made for it. <laughs> okay. I'm just doing this a little bit easier way, so we're not spending a ton of money. Do a filter by again. Let's buy this one, since it's a little bit cheaper. Let's see how I can figure out how to, to build this, because I've never done this before, so. Take this, put that onto there. Remove the back of this. Yeah, remove this. Let's put that on there. Do I have any scopes right now? Not really. Not really. I think I'm just going to bring in a dot anyway, so this will probably just go right on this. Oh, I need to get the rail, though. Let's go check this out. Filter by item. Mechanics got it. Yeah, this is a little bit cheaper option to do it this way, buying all of them individually. Take this off. Not you to that. Not you to that. I think the one that Skier sells is expensive. Maybe I should just buy what actually one of these. It would actually be cheaper. Take it. Put it right onto there. And then we need the mags, which I don't think I've got any fell mags. Maybe I do. Hey, I do, actually. <laughs> I've got the 20 rounders. I didn't know I actually had any. Okay, then we'll go over to Mr. The Peacekeeper? Yeah, it's Peacekeeper that I can buy stuff from. I'm gonna buy the silencer from you, buddy. Can I buy the silencer? <clears throat> Where is it located? Oh, there they are. <laughs> I'm like going right past them every time. By you. By this. This should attach. Oh, the slot's not empty. That's right. 
Take this tip off. Take you. Bada bing, bada boom. We got the weapon that we wanted. I would like to have kind of like the other scope. I got 77,000. So I'm going to have to make some money before I can really do anything. Let's do this. Mr. Mechanic. You can buy a couple of things, okay? You can buy the whole rifle. Buy the, the rip ammo because I'm never going to use it. You can take the ADAR. All this stuff here. Make 68,000 from that. Plus, we got to buy armor too. Gosh, the, A, the, A2, or the A1 is like really the best thing for us to buy. I think it's A1, isn't it? Or M1? M1. Right? Well, let's go do this. Let's do M1. A. No, that's a weapon. Gosh, what's it called now? Let's go look at the gear. Gear. Let's be a tactical rig. What's it called again? Oh, there it is. Oh, it's M2. It's the M2 rig. That's what it's called. It's not actually bad pricing. 60,000, but they're all like broken. One I normally buy is this one here. Jesus. Okay. Because then I can repair this guy, actually. Repair it. Let's see here. Hold on. 15. Not horrible. I think I could actually bought it. Could have probably bought a brand new one for cheaper. But whatever. Um, anything else we don't really need? Need the flash drive. Can't sell that. Which, by the way, why are you over there? Flash drive supposed to be in this one right here. Um, I'll sell the gauge for now. The gauge doesn't actually have to be found in raid. That's just for upgrading some stuff later. Filter 47. And how much does the trader buy it for? 36. It's only 10k difference. I'll just do that. So that's. And then we need a decent helmet. Decent helmet, please. I don't know if I should be running an Alton with that, with that helm or with a chest rig that I got. It doesn't really like match up. Although it will save my life a lot. Let's do this. Let's do that. Filter by item. These are expensive now. Why are they so expensive? We're gonna do this the other way then. Okay, so we need to do. Hold on. So it's six, five, and five. Okay. It's actually cheaper. So it's 90,000 for a helmet that's not even fully done. Technically, if you want a full one, about 100,000. So we do tape. One, two, three, four, five. Roughly, we're looking at about like 10K, 13K around there. Let's do plier. Five of these. One, two, three, four, five. That's roughly, we're at 60k now. Round players. One, two, three. Oops. Two, three, four, five, six. Roughly about the same, actually. <laughs> okay, so it's roughly about the same. But, oh well. Hope I don't want to go to hideout. Well, actually, while we're here. Laboratory. Get these. Let's just actually start one of these. Here it is. Let's get one of these going. Yeah, it's probably around the same cost, actually. Uh, now I look at it. Turn down for what? Now we need some ammo. I don't think I've got M80 on me. Got some. Yeah, I got some at least. Lost these in here. Buy a little bit more. Let's buy like 60. Let me put this down below. One and two. I know this takes a little bit longer now, guys, but honestly, I don't really know what we're going to run with nowadays. So it takes me a minute to, to find the, the right setup. 
We'll take this with us. We've got the Vaseline, so we'll just take the Vaseline with us for pain killing. Two grenades with us. Anything else? I don't think so. I think that should be good enough. Let's let's give that a try and see what hell we can do with that. I am just hoping that uh, this goes a lot better because, man, it's been rough. Shoreline is just a rough map, I feel like. 1900 will work. By the time we get out, it'll be nighttime. So maybe we'll get a little more cover on our way out. So let's try this again and cross our fingers, I guess. All right. I got really worried there for again for a moment there because it looked like it was about to do the same thing again. Oh, gosh. We're like... We're not the farthest spawn away, but we're pretty far back. So we got some running we gotta do. We gotta head all the way over there. Now, again, technically we could just take our time, loot through the city, and just make our way over there. But there's probably gonna still be someone at uh, at, at that place, no matter what. We're good. Full. Got the extra ammo. Got the health with us. We're good. We're we're gonna be in a good spot, I think. The only downfall of our whole setup we got we have right now is our chest rig. That's honestly the only thing that's our downfall. But I don't have anything that's really available and everything else is super expensive. We're gonna have to make some money soon. That way we can start getting those crazy pieces of armor. Or we said do our labs run. Our labs runs are coming up soon. I have that I have that set set for a specific day, so that way I have time to do it. Moving. But yeah, we have what seven? You have seven key cards right now to use. We definitely got enough to get a couple runs in for an episode. I just saw somebody. on top of the rock I swear to saw a player maybe not I can't tell whatever I, 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 I mean, I'm just seeing things. If I thought I saw a player walking for a moment. We'll say this before we go in. We're going to... We are going to painkill her a little bit. That's going to help us a tad bit in our fights. Granted, we're, we're so far into the raids now, like, it's so far into the wipe now, that it, it doesn't really matter. Like, I feel like no matter what, like, certain armors do help, but you're pretty much, like, screwed if you're if you're seen first and you don't have time to respond to the shooting. In, in certain aspects. Like, some, some parts you're okay. Like, you can still kind of, like, react and, and be okay during the fight. But there are some, there are some times it's just, like, you're you're not making it out. I'm on the west side, aren't I? Oh, it's 219. I was say, I thought I had one of the keys. Cool, got that. Now we need to make it to the other side. Actually, while we're over here, I kind of want to hit up 216. Only because of the grenades. Every single grenade counts. We got that one done. Now we gotta head over to the other side. That's me. Let 
We still we still should be painkillered. Go. And on this side we gotta do the same thing, 220. Trying to be cautionate. He's on the roof. Cool. Got that done. Do we have to exit this one? I think we do. Yeah, we do. No Ledex, unfortunately. Yes. I'm getting out of here. Yeah. We're fine. Guy's got a, like a VSS or something like that. Get him. I gotta do some surgery in a minute. Holy crap. Okay. I heard him coming too, so that's what I was like. Oh god. They're late fix and we'll be okay. Even if I get a run through for this, I don't really care. <laughs> I just wanted, I wanted to get that quest out of the way. Like, there's, I think there's other parts you have to go inside the resort again. But it's not like as bad as that one. I feel like if I'm gonna do resort, I gotta go with, the, with, the, with like a team. There's like no other option. So, that being said, most likely these upcoming streams, I will be doing quests with some, some viewers and some friends of mine. But do not worry. When we do it, we are gonna either do some pictures of it, or we'll we'll end up posting some of the videos. Now, if you guys want to see some of the vods from the actual live stream, we have not up to this point done any questing, so you didn't miss anything as far as questing goes. We've pretty much just been trying to win, trying to get money, and whatnot. To be honest, last last live stream we pretty much died, so we didn't really miss anything whatsoever. But uh, if you want to see those, it's on twitchtv live. You can check out the vods on there. Um, if I can get some more time on my hands from work, then I can try to upload those so you guys can see those, but the whole video is basically going to be there. I'm not sure if anything's been... So there may be a couple things clipped that you can check out. Alright, so we're going to go this way. He, did, he, pretty, he messed me up pretty good on the, on the armor. Someone die? Someone totally died over here. Unfortunate, my dude. Unfortunate. Yeah, like I said, we're probably gonna get a run through for this one, but it doesn't affect the quest, so it's not a huge deal. Well, at least we got the uh, spa tour part four out of the way. Man, that was thing was annoying. 
But I'm sure there's going to be more annoying quests ahead of us, so it's not a huge deal. Not a huge deal. Okay. Yep, we got to run through for it. That's all right, though. Oh, no, he was shooting at me with, um, actually, I don't know. Maybe an M4? It may have been an M4 he was shooting at me with. Okay. I know we definitely got to go back to Shoreline again for part five, I believe. Which we can do. Which I wouldn't mind actually doing. But let's go get this thing turned in. So let's go to Trader, Peacekeeper. Take it, man. Take it. It's yours, dude. It's yours. <laughs> you can have it. Get some money from that. Spots for part five. We got to find the locked resort rooms. I think this is located by the tank. There's like a little, like a little, like a uh, bunker thing. Look, it's like a bunker by the, the rock passage. That's where we got to go. Yeah. All right. So that's what we got to do next. I think what we're going to do as well. Not bringing the alt in now. I only brought the alt in so we, so we could get through the resort. I'm going to bring the regular armor again. Let's just do a quick repair. I can't even afford the repair. Never mind. Okay. We need to sell some stuff. Let's go to not well. Let's actually. I do have to check one thing in the hideout because I need to craft some more BP rounds. So we'll come over here. Where are my BP rounds? BP rounds. No, seriously. Where, where are my BP rounds? Should only take a golden. Oh, there it is. Okay, so we'll start that as well. That takes about yeah two and a half hours. Nutrition, we can get another sugar. And I don't have any more. Oh, I only got one. Okay. That's okay. We'll get some more soon. That's still upgrading. Got a lot of things still upgrading. Not a huge deal. Okay. Raiders, mechanic. Let's turn in a warage because I'm never going to use this war, war mage uh, uh, ammo. It's really bad ammo. I suggest never using that. If you ever have a chance to, don't use it. Sell that, sell that. Okay. Um, man, we're really poor. I got the VSS down here, actually. Or the AS Val, not VSS. AS Val. Sell the magazine. I'm really trying not to touch my stuff in here. Although one of the clocks, I think I can sell. I can sell one of the clocks because I don't need two of them. But we'll do that. I'll set in there. You don't get any more than the flea market. I already know this because I've checked it. Let's go back to our character. Let's do a quick repair. It's good there. We got what? 31,000. Okay. So we're going to take our money, go to therapist. And actually, we should get some money from this. It's going to be dollar bills, but that's okay. We'll get, what was I getting from you? I was getting something. What was I buying from you, therapist? Now I don't remember what I was buying. I think I want to go to Ragman. <laughs> I have thought in my head about what I was trying to buy from Therapist, and now I can't remember what. Buy that. That should be good. That gives us a little protection from that. We need to change out the IFAC now. Cool. I'll drop these off. I will, I'm will. i going to keep the morphine in case I need that. Do four and five on that. And beyond that... Can't afford any longer range scopes at the moment. I could, I could actually sell some of these things. I'll sell this pistol because I'm not going to use that. And I'll sell the MP9. Now we can buy it. Let's buy our normal Valde. I do, I do really enjoy that. Then I got to go to Peacekeeper, buy the other piece. Whatever it may be. There it is. Put this, remove you. Okay, and then we need to put this guy on. All right, I feel a little bit better. I'm still not really satisfied about the helmet, but we have to kind of go with what we got right now. Because we don't have a lot. We have a lot of mechanic stuff, or mechanic, yeah, mechanic stuff. We still got to finish up a lot of the, the gun stuff. Uh, we're going to check the fence real quick. Do a quick check. 
if anyone's accidentally selling the armor to them. Because these people, these people will do this on accident. Although I'm gonna have to have way more money. That's a, that's a problem. I just thought about that. Like people are gonna sell the armor on accident to them. We're just not not even, not even on accident. They just they just will sell it, sell it. We're looking for the six B forty three. The armor that we need, that zero to fifty percent. I just wanted to check a few times. Okay, yeah, unfortunately not. Okay, let's get going. Let's head back to Shoreline and let's just get these let's get these spall parts out today. That's that's really my goal. Let's get the spall parts done, and maybe we'll get some nice loot beyond that. Because now I can take my time. There's no worrying about anything. The resorts is going to happen another day. Flat X's, I will find you. But I'm going to need it to bring a group. It's a little smarter to do that way. Anyway, let's head to short line. All right, cool. We're in. Um, ooh, Manchu, we're heading towards the direction we need to go, which is this direction. We got to go by the rock pass. And uh, with everything being said, I'm actually okay with the fact that we're, we're not doing a lot of like killing right now for this episode. Because we need, I want to have like kind of in the in between episodes, or I got some that require killing, like for as far as certain quests we're doing, and then some that we just like focus on getting the loot. Like I want to always at least complete like one or two quests during each episode, just to keep progressing us. Because there are a lot that we still have left to go. It doesn't seem like we have a lot left, but we we do. We have a lot of freaking quests we gotta fit, still finish. I mean, we got you know Schubert and Heaven, which is gonna take me the longest. But the other ones, like, you know, spa part, I think it's five run right now. There's two more parts to this. And then, you know, you got all the cargo stuff and all that. So there's still a lot of stuff to do. And um, I want to be able to mix that with some with some type of money making. Now, we need to start utilizing our scab as well. Considering now that we've hit... Uh, I heard something to my right. Considering we hit level 40 now, we're not too worried about the leveling thing. Because we don't really, I think we need like sniping. Sniping is like, we need that to progress. For like, a, like I think it's a Jaeger quest we have to get. Which is fine. Like, we're going to get that at some point too. Um, but that's just kind of like, like through just like progression playing. And we'll get that one. Uh, not something we have to like directly focus on. And, well, I like snipers. SVDs are kind of one of my favorite things to use. So we're definitely going to be using those very soon. And we'll end up getting that at some point. I gotta be a little, a little bit careful here because there's obviously a player spawn in this direction. But I'm sure they've already moved towards the resort at this point. We're just gonna go all the way around. I should have brought my sick case to say we weren't going to resort, but not a huge deal. We still got our, uh, our Epsilon we can just stuff, stuff keys into if we get, get any more. There, there are a lot of keys we're actually missing. There's one specific key, and maybe you guys know about this more than I do. Which is probably what it is. Let's just be honest. But there is a specific key on reserve. It's like downstairs, like in like the cages. There's like four cages that are together that you need keys for to get inside of. And there's one that's like 700k. I don't know why it's so rare. Because it just seems like it's just like boxes for like, I think it's, I mean, maybe it's tech loot. Maybe that's why it's so expensive, but maybe you guys know. Let me know for sure down below in the comments because I'd be interested to know why it's so expensive. If there's like something that, oh, something else that spawns down there. Like a chance of it, of course. Right, it seems okay. Now, like I said, the, the only goal I have right now, we're gonna grab this item. We're gonna head over to the village. And then we're gonna we're gonna go through the village and just start plundering it and get everything we can. Uh, I do have a backpack, right? I don't have a backpack. That's okay. Well, and, well, hopefully we'll get, we'll get a scab or two that we can kill. And they'll have a scab backpack on them. I'm gonna be honest with you. I didn't have enough money, and it wasn't gonna, I wasn't gonna sell anything else because I am a little bit, a little bit broke, as you can see. And a lot of the stuff I have to hold on to for questing, and they're all found in raid items too. That's just frustrating to have to look for those again. Uh, sniper scab is not there. Okay. Oh, the rock package, package passage is actually open, but that's not where we're going. I'll leave us inside of this building here. I didn't look up the quest just because I somewhat remember it from memory. 
Come on, let's go check it out. There it is. Go. Oh, we got it. I'm actually while we're here. That one attachment actually may be, may be worth it. Make sure I'm not running face first into somebody. And we're out. We're outy. Probably get that scab that's over by the vehicle over here. He should be there unless we get a weird phenomenon again where he's not spawning and we could also go towards the cottage because I don't have the cottage key yet so it wouldn't be a bad one actually to check out we have to get out with the key so I, I still want to be a bit cautious about what we're doing If we get out with this rifle, I want to, not this episode, for next episode though, I'd like to do some modding to it. There's a couple more things that we can add to it to make it a bit better as far as like stabilizing it. Because like the grip we have is okay, but there's a better one. It's like that side grip that's like 46k or something like that. Wouldn't mind actually using that one. Hmm, no scabs. I like scab. I can't see you. You didn't have a backpack, but I'm still gonna check you. Pink killers, never say no to that. Yeah, let's head to the cottage as well, because I want to see if I can get the the cottage key to get inside the, the door there. And then, then we can try to kill like a scab or two to get some more XP and then also transfer a backpack. One thing too, I, and, and I know a lot of people keep telling me is to just buy the keys. You're right, I should. But like, resor like, like resort, I'm going to have to go to a lot now, considering we're now working on a lot of the spa quests and like the cargo stuff is going to send us back to the resort as well. Uh, I'm working on it, but they're kind of expensive some of the stuff and I'm just slowly starting to get used to learning like really good money-making routes Like the one I do on interchange actually yields me a lot of good money, but there's also a few reserve ones I gotta do Like the reserve ones make some really heavy bank like if I if I wanted to if I, like Which I may do in the future when I get another two days off which I think this coming Saturday I or this no, this coming Sunday. I've got like, Sunday Monday off again. We may do that. Like do a long stream. Like usually we only do like three hours. But I would like to get like one long stream in for like a month. And it'd be pretty much just money making. Just constantly running to the same exact place. Running back and forth, back and forth. Doing all the money loose we can. That's probably going to be on our agenda soon. Okay, the key's not here. I know there's some safes in here. I'm gonna check for the key, actually. No key. I'm not gonna go for these safes. Because there's no money exits I'm worried about. I'd rather keep the space for, like, keys and whatever else, else I can find inside the village. I'm quite surprised I did not see a scab around here. The old village. Someone's been here.
Darn, am I gonna if I just miss the opportunity to get all the loot here? That's not that's not worrying at all that the doors Not here anymore. Question is, do they go through the whole village? Or they just hit that up before moving on? <laughs> yes, these are the questions we must answer. We have must have answers too, I should say. Oh no, these haven't been hit. Take the money for now. Just in case we don't find anything else good. Oh, open sesame. Thank you. Okay. So it's just like one of those like fluke things. Someone went decided to go inside that house. Yeah, there's nothing else in here. Not a big deal. Oh, also that last episode where we um we we end up selling those uh, was less yeah it was, I think it was the last episode we end up selling all those corrupted hoses or corrugated hoses we we shouldn't have done that because <laughs> we we actually need it for a quest coming up I think it is I'm pretty sure it's gonna be meant for a peacekeeper quest so that was that's my bad <laughs> we're gonna have to go get some more but we can either craft them or find them either way. Interchange has always got a ton of them, and you only need two of them, so. We'll definitely get some more. And the keys are not, uh... Oh, someone's been through here. So they've already hit all that. I guess they didn't know about the one behind the door, I guess? Interesting. This is a weird loop pathing. Some things are hit and some things aren't. Alrighty then. Wait up the shops real quick. We can go actually see if the uh, if the if the, uh, the the cabin safe key is there, which I rarely ever find it. I've only found it once in. Two and a half years. So, <laughs> maybe we'll finally get lucky. I'm hoping. All right, someone's been through here. Surprised I didn't take the sodium. Sodium's actually, it's got some value to it. It's not the most expensive thing in the world, but there's definitely some value to it. They've been in there. I'm gonna start collecting those. Start collecting all that fun stuff because you know Alton's Alton's are expensive. If we can just collect the items ourselves, we'll be fine. Ooh, Plex. Always need Plex. I'm always running out of it. No key. No key at all. Sad days. Alright, let's get out of here. That's enough loot that we can at least say that we got some type of money out of it. We're not gonna make a lot. Honestly, we're not going to get a ton, but and I think actually 90% of this we're going to keep. <laughs> I think the only thing we're going to sell is the bolts and then that, that's, uh, that's, uh, what do you call it? The muzzle. The muzzle item. All right, cool. Bada bing, bada boom. We made it out and I won't say no to that. <laughs> hmm. Okay. 
let's get that one turned in. Can't do anything yet again. Like I said, the MPX is going to require us to get that one laser. Uh, I feel like Kiba's going to have it. I've got it like the I've got it up on like a sticky note in front of me. So now I know like if I if I like need that one, I know the name of it now at least. So every laser I see, I basically been looking at trying to find out if that's the one I need. Okay. Now I'm just I'm debating if I want to do a, a loot run. Which would probably be smart. Let's go do a scab run, actually. Let's go do a scab run. First of all, let's turn this in. Cool. Got that one done. Spar Tour Part 6. Requires $8,000. You won $8,000, huh? And yeah, we, we unlock... Oh, okay, actually, we unlock M62. That's not a bad deal. Not a bad deal, actually. Turn all the dollars over. Plex. I'll put the plex away. It's in that one. Okay. Okay. OCD is just gonna have to get. It's just gonna have to suck it up today. Suck it up, OCD. I'm just gonna toss the stuff in so we can move on. I'm not organizing. This is not the organizing episode. We'll do one of those later on. Get all the money. Drop off the ADAR. Extra painkiller, we'll toss inside the meds. Drop these off. Cool. Okay. I think that's good there. We'll sell the rest of the stuff in a second. Let's go do... Actually, we got some dollar bills from that, actually. Hold on. And some IFAX, too. That's nice. Peacekeeper will turn in the money. We're a little bit closer. Okay. Let's head out with our scav. I want to go over to reserve. See what we can do. So let's set up a reserve and make some money. Oh wow. We're here with 35 minutes left. And the alarm's going off. Things are going great. No rocking. Okay. We're at rocking tracers today, apparently. Let's head over this direction. That didn't last very long. I couldn't really hear anything either. I heard someone, like, I heard something. I thought it was behind me. It was in front of me. <laughs> well, that means we're just going to go into reserve on a regular player base. <sighs> I swear, I, I thought I heard something, but wrong direction. Did I even hit him is the question. I did. At least I hit him. That's all I care about. As long as I at least hit the guy. It at least tells me like, hey, at least I'm not super crappy. <laughs> all right. We're going to go over to. Yeah, let's go, let's go to reserve. Why not? We have a couple different path things that we like to do for loot anyway. Let's grab a backpack now. I could actually bring an attack too, just for the fun of it, since I got two of them for free, basically. Yeah, this will work. Okay, let's head out there. Make sure, actually, we gotta switch our keys over. Put this one here. We got all resort keys. Or, no, resort, reserve keys, reserve keys. There we go, got them. Okay. Let's just, uh, yeah, let's give that a try. See what happens. Let's go. Go. All right, we're in. And we got the. Should have the gamma up a little bit. I want to do this at night time. Okay, you can make it down this without killing yourself. Just gonna be careful. All right, there we go. I've almost like broken my legs four times doing that before, so I always like to be a little bit more cautious about that. Now for the left side of me. We're gonna hit the tech spawns up first, and then we're gonna go hit up the um, medical spawns. Let's 
some cable. Not the most expensive items, but it's it's still money. I'm always keeping an eye out too because of the vertex. If we can get the vertex, um, that will save us a lot of time. Because otherwise, once we get the medical thing upgraded, we're gonna have to craft one. Drill, nothing there. Yeah, we're gonna have to craft a vertex ourselves, and I don't remember what the crafting is on that one. But it's definitely going to be required to finish up that Peacekeeper quest. I think it's Len Lease Part 2, I think it's called. I don't like closing that door. Simply because of the fact that someone opens, if someone sees the door close, they know immediately someone's in this in this place. I try to say somewhat incognito the whole time. Like I'll, I'm gonna end up closing those doors when we leave this room. Nothing. Okay. And the doors don't make a lot of noise like some of the maps we play. So it's okay that we're doing that. This is uh, a little less than I was expecting. Usually, I make I usually get a little bit more than this. But no big deal. Oop, there we go. That's some good stuff there. Get to the roof quickly. Guy's yeah, got night vision. There's only one exit. Most likely gonna heal while he's in there. I'm 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 okay with chilling for a second too. He, like I said, he, he really has nowhere he can go. I just saw the laser from him. He's definitely looking out. Position them. Well, he he may be able to jump out the window, but I don't think he can. Bro, you're dead. You're so dead. <laughs> Brave man. Okay, I'm 
pretty sure we have in the head. We're gonna have to slow that down. Oh, come on, game! Ugh! Dark off! Am I being bamboozled here or like what? Ah. Brutal, man. Brutal. I'm pretty sure I one tapped him in the face. Of course, when I go back, it's, I'm going to watch it and I like miss him slightly to the left. <laughs> that may have been the guy that's, um, I was shooting earlier. Yeah, that's BP rounds. Man. Brutal stuff, dude. Brutal, brutal, brutal. Got to think of a plan here. What would be the best plan and course of action of this? I think a pistol run. I think a pistol run. I'm not really getting any losses. If I die, it is what it is. We'll just bring in helmet. Yeah, I just want a little bit of protection for the face. Grab that. I'd like to bring a rig. So we can kind of capitalize on what we got. We got 29. We'll bring this guy in. Okay, well, let's go do our run. I'll bring this in just so we have some type of healing. And we'll bring the painkillers as well. And let's just cross our fingers that this one goes really well. If I see a player, I'm just going to kind of gadaddle and not let that happen again. But let's do this. Let's do... I'm okay with doing a, a morning one. That'll work. Cross your fingers, friends. We need money. Let's do this. Okay. We're in. Same as X spawn, too. All right. Cross our fingers. This time, we won't have bad luck. Especially on that guy. I was not expecting... Uh, I was not expecting to get killed like that. But then again, he, like, like I said, he probably jumped out the window. Although I thought I would hear him jumping out the window, but who knows. We got armor piercing rounds in the pistol that we're using right now. So, hey, if it works out, it works out. I do like this pistol a lot, though. Got a good feeling to it. Not as good as the, uh, the FN, but still packs the punch. That with us. Just trying to keep an eye out. And listen out for anybody. Oh, okay. I need that apparently. Quite certain that's gotta be found a raid, so we gotta be careful now. I don't know if we need the CMS kits anymore. I think we're good on that quest. This time I'm just running through. Since we're not doing it nighttime. I'll get him from the second floor. Something's going on over there. I was like, I don't know, it could be players fighting, could be scabs fighting at this point, I don't know.
Fun fact, CMS kits actually suffer a decent amount. It's like 30k each. Doesn't seem like a lot, but it's a decent amount, especially when you don't have any money. Actually, let, let's actually correct what we just said there. It's money. We're not going to complain. <laughs> We've got what we, we're going to get what we can get. Check for any intel. Intel does sell for good money. No intel. Okay. Thing on the ground. Thing up there. Up there. A little Rifac, though. If anything, we'll get some more healing out of this. They're in that tower over there. Kind of messes my plan that I'm working on here. Should be covered from where I'm at. Pretty sure scab boss is here. That, it sounds like that's what they're shooting at. All above me too, so let them do their thing. That, especially with it, you know, I could let them. Oh gosh, did I just see somebody? How do you get in there without a key? Oh, there's a double side from that. I didn't realize that. Yeah, yep, I'm dead. Ah, all right, all right. Yeah, hey, yeah, uh, hey, Dar. I can tell. <laughs> Sad days, man. Some days are not always the same, as you guys always know, no matter what. If it's a brutal day, if it's a great day, you're going to see everything. And today, my friends, was a brutal day. Brutal indeed. But at least we, we, we did get some progression, which is good. Oh, that hurts, though. And I barely even scratched him. Yep. It is what it is. It is what it is. Dang, dang, dang. Well, you know what? At least it tells us that, you know, Tarkov will give and will take. But we've been getting a lot of gives more than takes lately, so. I can't complain too much, but. I do think this is actually going to be the end of this episode. It may be a little bit shorter than the other ones, but. 
That's okay. That's okay. I'm pretty sure that VPX is completely worthless. The import. Yeah, it's completely useless. We can, um, we may be able to do some crafting with it. So I'm going to hold on to it because especially when we finish up the medical center, we'll see what the intelligence center will give us. But we have to upgrade the intelligence center after that. It's a long thing progress. You know how it goes. But hopefully you guys enjoyed this uh, unfortunate, sad, hurtful episode. <laughs> if you did, make sure you guys give it a thumbs up. Make sure you guys leave a comment down below about what made you feel all the pain like I did today during this episode. Let me know what you felt most painful about. <laughs> uh, let's go turn, actually, let's go start another sugar before we go. But if also, if you're new to the channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Make sure you hit the notification bell so you never miss a single episode because we've got a lot more coming. Like a lot more. Or than I would say, uh, like, I'm thinking probably like 60 at this point. And I'm going to love every moment of it. Every bad, every good, everything. I'll see you guys in the next one. Have a good day.